Hello again in Sketchware Gold Tutorials. In this new tutorial, I will uh, show you how we can use uh, local library in Sketchware Gold Beta Plus version. So, if you don't have this version, please uh, watch the previous video. I will uh, put the link in the description and download this version. Okay? But please watch the video till the end to understand what's new in this version. Okay? So, uh, I will click here on uh, create new project. And, uh, sorry for sketch uh, for Android 10. It's some uh, troubles. I will fix them in next update, and I will fix other uh, bugs. Okay, so we will return with you in next update uh, with uh, some extra features. So let we uh, create here a project. Then we will talk. You can uh, fix what you want. Add what wherever you want. I will not add anything. Okay. Save it. So uh, this is my local library. We have here two options: the plus button to add an exist library, and this three points here to config new library. So how we can config a library? Okay. So basically, you will find a folder in you with uh, the with the zip that you download from my website. Uh, so copy this this library to Sketchware. The library and put it here. So how we can create the new library? Just uh, open this folder, create the new uh, folder here. Name card here uh, folder. I will name it. Then excite. Okay, and let me search for uh, our uh, folder. Is here. Okay. So uh, first, uh, use uh, you can use other tools if you have. Just you need uh, dex uh, file, jar file, and if you need a uh, resource, please use them. Okay, add the resource if need. If it doesn't need, don't add them. And you will need a config file. Okay, so uh, you can use uh, uh, Maven in uh, IDE to download libraries and compile them to a apk then you just need to extract uh, libraries okay so i will explain to you okay like i want to use this code view just uh, for example or android.net whatever i will delete the message i will delete everything here just to make for you a uh, example Okay, save this. So how it's work? Let we see that we don't have a resource file. I will extract here classes. I will name it classes, just classes the text like this. Then click one click and uh, choose text to jar. Okay. This is uh, the free version of uh, MT Manager. I don't use it for mod or anything. Okay. It's just a normal version. After that, I will create a file. Okay, dash file config without uh, an extension, just config excite. And let me see that I will add it here uh, the package. Okay, I will add it here. Let me see that this is the package dot this got gold. Okay, let me see that this is the package. We are just uh, saying that. The name of the folder is who. So we return to Sketchware. Click on these three points here and right here. Who. And just click added live. It will add it live successfully. As you can see here, it's uh, added in your uh, project or in your uh, uh, folder. Okay. It's perfect. So if you have a resource, uh, don't use the resource from a compiling uh, f project. Use it. Uh, you can download use it. How uh, oh, I can explain to you? Don't copy the resource from exist API. Okay? Use it from a project. So that is all for this. So I will uh, close this. We don't need it anymore. I will click here. I will uh, add a library for a test. We, can, we have here PDF view, YouTube player, uh, for the YouTube player, and this. 
I don't add uh, the config, please add the config for them and fix them or I will fix them for you, okay? In next update. So I will choose something. I will choose broccoli here. Huh? And I will add a uh, linear. Inside my linear, I will... Uh, sorry, let me move this here. I will configure it. I will add some design. You can choose the color but it doesn't matter because it will change. I will put here a text and I will write here loading. I will go to on creator but we first let we add the broccoli. Just add it here broccoli BRC and go to library here. Select this broccoli here, yeah. broccoli, okay. set view, our linear one, first color will white, second color will, um, okay, this amber, and duration it will, two seconds, then you show broccoli, of course we will compile and get some errors, let me see them. Uh -huh. Yes, no error. Uh, if you have any error, please send the screenshot to me about your error. So let me see this beautiful. Oh, it's so beautiful as you can see here. Nice uh, library that gives you a beautiful design in your application. Okay, but this is not the only effect for uh, this library. It have many type of effects. You can check them by search for broccoli library on uh, internet, and you can use them. We have here more libraries if you want to use uh, more libraries. Let's see. We have here file picker. We have here Lottie. Uh, text but view we have a uh, lot of libraries so let me add a text but view okay and i will add it here a routing bar this will be as uh, we will convert this so give me one second so this is the text but here where i get the library as you can see here so, uh, if you want to download it in your uh, use Gradle system, you can use this. Okay. So, uh, I will take a sample. So, let's go to our sketch word and here I will first, uh, I will convert this with gate. Okay, it's beautiful now. So, what we need more, we need to add a some things okay here i will copy the id again and let me see we have this extra uh, things i will select them all of them and go here to inject XML, just make them separate. Okay. For your Java, you will use here start uh, animation. Sorry, we will check this. From one to zero, or from zero to one. Okay. We can close this. We don't need this anymore. I will explain to you how to use this also. So I will add that here. Uh, this. Okay. It will be from an exist. It will disappear. The text. Start with uh, ready text and make it disappear. So here I will make it. Twenty twenty. Sorry, twenty twenty. It will check our XML and check time. Okay, so we have here uh, our uh, text path view. Let's run and see if we have any error. 
no error and it will compile so faster that's what uh, I make it for you in sketch for code make it the compiler so faster okay as you can see here it takes just a few seconds to compile and as you can see here we have used here uh, two libraries together there is no errors both of them work in your application and I think this is all for uh, libraries in this tutorial. I will see you again in new tutorials. Have a good with you and please subscribe in our YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.